the valley's but Right, we're here, Valley's Extreme. We're starting in the car, or in the car this week. Here, 500, gets up. I actually got here about an hour ago. I've been and had a quick look around at some parts of the track, and it looks very, very difficult. And that's tomorrow's track. Today's is a bit easier. No plan whatsoever for this vlog. I'm without Ed, I'm without Roxanne. Roxanne's actually back tomorrow. I'm seeing many, many pink hats all over the place. It's pretty mad. Um, I think there's like 500 riders at this race this weekend. <laughs> I've never been here before, I don't really know what the crack is. I know, all I know is I'm meant to be ready in 20 minutes. Well, I've rambled on far too much, I've probably got about three people left watching, so for you three people, much love, and we'll crack on with the vlog. Can we have some hats on display, please? We're wearing them. Get mixed. And that's true, that's a good point, that. Let's see, that's why you are stood there, and I've stood here. You good? Been busy? Very busy. Don't lie. You haven't been busy because I seen the race bike from Super Enduro yesterday and it's still dirty. Oh yeah, I haven't done that yet. What yeah. year bike's this? <laughs> I don't actually know. It's a bit of a 2019, bit of 20, bit of 22. We don't actually have any bikes in England at the minute really, so... Fat Cat, oh no, I told you how I got the one for Fat Cat. This one, re that was a bit of a bitter. This one really is a bitter, but... I haven't actually sat on or started or done anything to do with a two-stroke or extreme since Abistoni, which was July, so we are well prepared. <laughs> Shock, you haven't got kicks on. <laughs> You've only got fucking 30 pairs. All right, Jack? Yeah, you? Yeah, wonderful. You're not getting kitted up, right? I was thinking I might get ready soon. We're going in like 10 minutes. Right, while I'm hiding in the back of the van, well, I'm not hiding, I'm getting changed. So you've got two days of racing this weekend. This is a new hoodie, by the way. It's not out yet. Will be soon. I have no shame. We have a qualifying day today where you, you line up in a row, someone walks past you, and you set off one by one. I think that's such a good way to start. Anyway, bit of relevant information. But so you set off one by one. So we're qualifying today for start order for tomorrow. Day is a small special test, which we're going to do one sight and lap, and then two timed laps, and your best time counts. That gives you a starting order for tomorrow. And then tomorrow, you do two laps of the same, and then the third lap has three no help zones, which are very difficult. I've been and looked at them a little bit this morning, and I think they're gonna get quite tasty. So, it's a pretty difficult race. Like I just said, I literally haven't even sat or rode on a two-stroke or anything since Abistoni. So it's quite good to blow the dust off. And, um, have a good time. Have you walked anything tomorrow? Oh, the three hard bits. Fucking hard. Hard. Now while it's hot. Should be bang on 40. Is that's it done now, isn't it? I think so. There's not like a top 10 shootout or anything. No, it was there was a night race last year, but there's not this year. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, we're done with day one. It's been another look at the track. Track for tomorrow is so difficult. Like, it's, it's going to be such a hard race. I'm actually really looking forward to it. I'm not looking forward to the state of this and the cleaning bill that I'm probably going to get. Now, I'm in this, by the way. It's a rental car, obviously. I don't own a Fiat 500. It means I can go straight to the airport Sunday night, stay there, fly back. Studying that. Fly back to Spain Monday morning. That's the plan. I'll see you tomorrow. Two day vlogger. Rolling on the rollover. It's been a while since we've been at a two day race. In the rallies, but. It's raining. I'm pleased it's raining because what use would a race in England be without the rain there? Eh? No use whatsoever. It's fucking pissing it down. Get us a poncho, please. Look at that. That's worked out well, hasn't it? They even come with a little visor. I'm not actually, this wasn't actually intended to be a sales plug for Ride Nutrition and the fact we sell ponchos. It was just pure coincidence. Supply and demand, I guess you'd call it. There's a demand today and we have the supply. Pink beanies as well. I'll, sorry, sorry, I'll stop now. I'll stop now. Are you paying, bud? Could you say now, bud, please? Can't, can't. We've had a right. pit change today. Huh? You fancy the concrete today, did well, you? Know someone at the park there where we were. Oh yeah. So it's actually better. Yeah, it's better. Can sell more shit today. Anyone want to buy out? Right, there we are. Let's just had a major sort out on the go. Yeah. I've got some jobs to be doing here. Yeah, who's first? Me. Ooh. Me. Who? Me. Rock, paper, scissors between you two. 
Oh, he's won. Right, I've lost the pen. Pen's in here still. There we go. I'll cut his knife here, the one you've done the video for. Ah, oh, here we go. You like that? Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. Right, there we go, we're packing up. I'm not sure what order anything's gonna come out. I did try and upload my GoPro from qualifying yesterday, last night, but Welsh Wi-Fi was not giving me the upload speed necessary. It's been a sick weekend, thank you to Valley's Extreme for having us. I've actually thoroughly enjoyed coming back and doing this race. Crowd's been awesome, pink beanies everywhere, sick to see. Anyway, back to Spain tomorrow morning, a few days riding Super Enduro, then we got round three of the Super Enduro Championship in Budapest this weekend. Good on!